scroll my team coins, check out thefootshop.com. Their link is in the description below. And for a discount on your coins, use Nepo at checkout. What's up, guys? Nepenthes here, and welcome to a FIFA 12 video. What the fuck? What the fuck is this? This is FIFA 12. What the fuck is this? Holy shit, man. Holy, what the fuck? Like, I can't believe this game is still online. Um, on the other day, I posted on um, Instagram some all my FIFAs from FIFA 09 to the current FIFA. And I started having a look back, and I've got one FIFA 12 account that's left that has stuff in it and isn't just, like, reset or banned or something or other. I don't know. Um, first of all, I want to take you through the club and just show you the players I had. I don't know if you guys were even around in FIFA 12. Yo, drop a like on the video anyway, but especially if you are around in FIFA 12. Look at that for a card. 88 rated purple Sergio Ramos. Oh yes, indeed. He has had three owners. I bought him for 260,000 coins. I could probably sell him now for like 15 million coins. I don't have enough coins to open a pack. We're gonna discard Osvaldo, right? Do I still get 10,000 coins for him? Yeah, because we're like I, he's probably worth way more than that. Because there's no one on the market. Look at that, Diego. See how it doesn't like? Look how different that was. 64,000 I bought Diego for. Look how different that is. It's so different. It doesn't give you the weak foot, the skill moves. It doesn't give you the work rates. It's crazy. We got Inform Ronaldinho, Inform Thiago Neves. Look at that purple Sergio Ramos, guys. 85 pace, 92 defending, 95 heading. Holy shit, we get Dede, the motherfucking centre back. Oh, yes. Inform Mike on the 80. This guy was going for about a million coins. Around the time, uh, around the time he was released, Renato Augusto in form, Diego Cavalieri in form, Van der Leij in form, Marcos Asensio. I, I, I can't even remember what kind of car is this team of the year? Was it team of the season? I can't even remember, guys. But we get Asensio there as well, and then we get Danilinho in form again. This guy was going for like a million coins. We get Cristiano Ronaldo. Look at that formation card, guys. We have morale, morale, fitness, and contracts, mate. Morale, fitness, and contracts. We get Luis Nani when he was rated 87 with five star skills. Holy shit. Danny Alves at 86. Giuseppe Rossi at 85. Buffon, 85. Valdez, 85. Lucio, look how good he was. 76 pace, 85 defending, 83 heading. Ashley Cole, yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah, yeah, Ronaldinho, Vincent Compagni, uh, Renato Augusto, five-star skills, of course, Joe Hart, Per Mertesacker, what a god, what an absolute god, David Luiz, the most OP motherfucker for about 10 years, Theo Walcott, we've got uh, Javier Saviola, because this guy scores goals for fun, man, he's got five-star skills in this game, Jordi Alba there as well, Andre Schurler as a striker, guys, as a striker, look at that, 89 pace, 83 dribbling, 83 shooting, the players go on, man, Daniel Sturridge, Back when he was a striker for Chelsea, Czech Teote, Tarap, Morales as a striker, Asaidi though, five star skills, Carl Walker still as fast as ever, Fernandinho who used to have the five star skills as well, Gabby Agbon Lahore, the most OP motherfucking striker in this game, Fabio Contral, Leo Gargo because he was just too sick, and then all those Brasilvas. You guys remember that shit, El Sharawi, holy shit, that guy's got some abilities, five-star skills, more five-star skills, Morais, remember him? God damn, look how many goals I've scored with him, 109 and 122 games, and Nino, he was so, oh my god, look at the goals, 283 in 233 games, Gianni Fatsidis, five-star skill moves, god damn, he was good to play with, this guy, Leandro Silva is his name. I don't know why they've got Lima there, but he's Leandro Silva, our first owner, first one. Pack pulled, mate. Pack pulled. We get Canu, used to go for like a billion coins. Wellington Silva, the uh, the Arsenal player, he has five star skills in this game. Marcio Azevedo, the left back with five star skill moves. Holy shit. And uh, then we go into the bronzes, some more, some more, uh, you know, some, some more. Look at a fucking win with uh, how much. I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know. How much pace he had there, 96. This is a team, I'm gonna play a couple of games with it, see if I can get some clips. I don't know if people still play this game, if I'm gonna find a game or if this is just gonna be some kind of club tour. Um, but this is this was basically like my, when I did play to win in FIFA 12, I went I think 68 games, 68 wins in a row with this team. It was so goddamn good. It was so good. Ronaldo and Contra, that perfect uh, perfect synchronization for the chemistry. Of course, nine chem was the best you could get back in that day. Back in day, of course, we have to swap those two around like that. Boom, there you go. Everyone gets on nine chem. 
Whew, look at this, DA. Oh, man. This bench, this team. Holy shit, this should be fun to play with. Skill moves were so sick in FIFA 12. Let's go into the store, see if we can afford a pack. Let's see. We, oh, damn. Look at that. Oh, shit. We've got premium gold jumbo. I haven't got enough for that. 40 remaining. Oh, you can only open 40 a day. Let's go with it. You can't even use FIFA points. They don't even have FIFA points in this game. Let's see what we get in a pack. Pack. Wait, I didn't even see what I said. Did I say Ronaldo? I better have said Ronaldo. Yo, look at packs. They're still shit. Packs are still shit. Oh my god. We get a squad fitness card. That's pretty sick. We'll keep that. This is back in the day when you could only have 50 consumables. Damn, man. I'm going to discard. How do you discard in this one? Like R2 goes there. Is it R1? Does R1 discard? Whoa, whoa, whoa. R1. Nope. Um, actions. Quick sell remaining items. 2,000 coins back. Fucking love that. Let's go and have a look at my trade pile. I haven't actually looked at the trade pile on this account. Maybe we've got some decent stuff on there. Um, trading uh, trade pile. And we'll also have a look at like some of the players. We've got a couple of injury cards, a fitness card, another Wellington silver there, a left wing to a left mid. That's pretty decent. Oh, damn, we've got Levetsi and a 41212 card. They used to go for like 10,000 coins, shooting plus 10. Look at that Levetsi, guys. Woo, first owner, Lovetsy, 92 pace. He's got five-star skills on this one as well. 82 shot, 82 pass, 94 dribbling. Let's go and have a look on the uh, on the market and just see if there's any players being sold, any players being bought. What have we got? Look at these guys. They're not going for shit. They're not going for shit. Is there even... Yeah, like, there's literally... Ne oh, my God, that 92-rated Xavi. Holy crap. He's at 22 minutes. There's literally nothing on the market of Frank Ribéry for 48k. I reckon that Ronaldo I've got might go for a serious amount. David Silva, Dempsey there as well. We got Mika Richards for 10k. Robin Van Persie back when he was an Arsenal player. Gail Clichy as well. There really isn't too many players left on this. Uh, wait, is that the same? I think that's the same. Uh, the same players right there. Um, I literally I've got some of the best players available in FIFA 12. What I'm going to do, guys, uh, this this was all done live. I'm going to go and see if I can get a couple of uh, couple of games on this FIFA 12. I don't know if people are still playing FIFA 12. Uh, we're going to have a we're going to have a look and find out. Oh damn, I've got an upgraded Lavetsi. That's what I'm talking about. EA You're hooking me up, not hooking me down. Um, yeah, I'm going to go and see if I can play a couple of games. That record I've got, holy shit, man! Look at that shit, man! Fucking 470 wins, 200 losses. That's actually a terrible record considering how good I actually was at FIFA 12. But um, I can't remember the login details to my other accounts. But I'm going to go see if I can get into, another, into a game, guys. And I will be right back. So, guys, I did end up finding a game. However, it was against the starter pack team. Of all the things I could come up against, a starter pack team was first. Um, I wasn't expecting a difficult game. One thing I will say, though, is this: the, the, the graphics... Oh, man, how far they've come in just three years is literally crazy. I look at this on screen now, it looks ancient guys, it really does, the gameplay felt ancient, it felt like just clunky, the dribbling wasn't bad. When we when we play FIFA now, we take for granted what we have. I know there's a lot of issues within FIFA, I know there is, but we genuinely take for granted what we have because this game compared to FIFA 15, they are worlds apart. And I know, you know, now we're on next gen console, this was previous gen, uh, you know, this is three years old. But my God, this is, it, it was fun to go back and play one game. I actually couldn't get more than a second one game. Like I couldn't find an opponent for a second game. But anyway, guys, I just thought I'd show you a FIFA 12 club. Maybe I'll do this for FIFA 13. I've got, a, oh man, I've got a club and a half on FIFA 13. And maybe FIFA 14 as well. As far as I understand, the servers on all the other FIFAs are actually down. Uh, prior to FIFA 12, so I can't show you anything on FIFA 11, FIFA 10, or FIFA 09, but we can do FIFA 11, FIFA 12, and FIFA 13, so if you enjoyed this video, guys, if you enjoyed a FIFA 12 club tour, drop a like, let me know in the comment section uh, that, you, that you enjoyed it, that you want to see more, and if you still play FIFA 12, because there is still an active market, there are still people playing why do you still play this game opposed to FIFA 15? Anyway, just as you hear the, the noise in the background, I'm going to end here because I don't want you to have to sit through that. There's people in my house doing work and I still have to make videos. But this is the end of the video, so thank you guys for watching. Hopefully you enjoyed it and I'll see you next time. I'm out. Peace.